Hi everyone and welcome to week four. So uh, we're getting right into the substantial part of the course now and I hope that you're really, just really starting to see where the course is taking you with regard to uh, the structures of um, paragraphs that you'll be using when you write your essay in this subject. Um, there's two main tasks that you need to be focusing on this week. The first one is that you will finish the work of module two that's in the study guide, um, including the associated readings that go with that um, module that are in the resource materials. Um, but perhaps the most important thing you will be doing this week is completing assignment one, which is um, due next Monday, uh, July the 30th, and it's um, you submit it by uploading your word processed file through Moodle. So in this week's topic um, section for week four, uh, there are a number of resources that you need to look at very carefully before you submit that assignment. There is a model assignment there that there's a link to uh, that you can look at and read through from a past student and that just gives you a basic idea of what your assignment should look like, uh, how it should be formatted uh, and how it should be set out. There's also a link to um, a web page within Moodle that's uh, a help sheet or submission guidelines and that's got a great list of things that you need to make sure you have done and that you have worked through and that you check um, with your assignment before you submit it. And then there are, there's also a link to a PDF um, document that takes you through step by step the, step by step the instructions for up, actually uploading your assignment to Moodle. So that's the most important uh, task at the end. So the biggest piece of advice I'd give you with regard to that assignment is don't leave it till the last minute, particularly uh, as it's due on Monday morning at 9 o'clock. Um, if you have big difficulties with it over the weekend, uh, it's not guaranteed that you'll be able to contact me immediately. Uh, so don't leave it till the last moment to try and do everything there. If you do think you're going to need an extension, for a specific reason um, and you will need some supporting evidence if you're requesting an extension. You must ask for that before the due date so you need to do that either by phoning me or sending me an email and then we will talk about um, whether the extension has been granted and what your new due date would be. But my advice to you is to, if you can, avoid an extension at all costs because it will just make you um, get behind with what's coming up in the course in the next two weeks. So read carefully all the instructions, make sure you follow them and then also make sure if you have any questions at all with um, assignment one of anything that you're not sure about that you either email or phone me or ask a question on the discussion forum. So I'm really wishing you all the best with those tasks, particularly the assignment for this week and uh, we're really looking forward to seeing your beautiful work that you're handing next Monday. So I will talk to you again then.